Hi, I'm Sarah. And I'm Vincent. And today we are here to talk about the fascinating difference between homogeneous and heterogeneous mixtures. So, let's get started. A heterogeneous mixture is a mixture where its components are not uniform. To explain this in simpler terms, it's a mixture where you can clearly see its different components. For example, if you take a look at soup, you can easily point out its ingredients, the vegetables, noodles, the meat, etc. Each component is clearly visible. Other examples include rocks, oil and water mixed together, and beach sand. If you take a look at beach sand, you'll notice that you'll not only find sand on the floor, but also shells and rocks and other things. Since all these components are not uniformed and they're easy to spot out, this makes sand a heterogeneous mixture. Now a homogeneous mixture is a mixture where the components that make up the mixture are uniformly distributed throughout the mixture. For example, sugar water. If you have a glass of water and then pour sugar into it, the sugar will dissolve and disappear. The sugar is still in the water, but is distributed thoroughly, making it difficult to point it out. Other examples of homogeneous mixtures include air and blood. Because we don't see carbon dioxide molecules floating around the air, this makes the air uniform, making it a homogeneous mixture. Now let's review these topics one more time. A heterogeneous mixture is where the components are not uniform. A homogeneous mixture is where the components are uniformly distributed throughout the mixture. We hope you found our video useful and helpful, and thank you for watching.